Hey everyone, welcome back to Barrier's Workshop. In today's video, we have the 127th flyover of the Nicholas site in Coolidge, Arizona. Today's video is cut short a bit because we had a problem with our gimbal on our camera. It wasn't a safety issue with a, not having to worry about the drone falling out of the air, uh, but you'll see it at the end of the video. So the drone flying wasn't a problem, but the angle was like, it was at like 45 degrees. And the best way to fix that is to recalibrate and it needs to be done in front of a computer. So we brought the drone back so that we could do that when we get back to the office. So we didn't get good views of a lot of things that we normally do, but we do have some things to mention. The assumed dyno building area has had the next layer put down over the vapor barrier. We had a sun glare and couldn't get a great angle to see what it was besides gray in color. It looks like concrete, but I can't say for sure that it actually is. The parking lot progress continues with more borders on the north side and we can see that the start of the construction for the entrance on the southwest side of the site has begun. This entrance will be for deliveries once both entrances and the parking lot are complete. We also saw a Nicola tray being a BEV being brought out on a semi. Uh, looks like it's going out. I don't think that it's being delivered to a customer uh, but maybe it is for all we know. We just don't know where it's going but it's being taken off site, it's constructed, it's complete, it's ready to go to its next destination. Could be for testing, could be for a customer. Uh, maybe we'll find out uh, sometime soon. So that will be pretty exciting to find out if it actually went to a customer since Nicholas says they will be getting up to 25 delivered to customers this year. Also, we saw another BEV, uh, kind of hard to see. He was connected to a trailer. He was right by the charging station and it was a, uh, a darker in color. So we almost missed it in the shadows but we did see it. So there's two BEVs there. One was leaving the site and one looks like it was doing some testing by hauling a, a uh, trailer around. Uh, we're gonna be doing our next live stream of the Nikola site next Monday. So please look out for that. We will also be doing a fast charging stream with Brian for my Tesla weekend next Tuesday at 4 p.m. Pacific time. We hope you enjoyed this video. And if you like it, please hit that thumbs up button. If you haven't already, please subscribe to see more content like this in the future. You can follow us on Twitter at Bears Workshop. And thanks to all of our patrons. We appreciate you guys. Now, let's go fly.